Hey, welcome back. Big things are happening this time because we're invading Richmond. That's right, we're taking over this place. There's a new king of the roost, and it's me. All right, everybody. It's like we're playing Call of Duty. Everybody's crouching behind a car. You know Javi Garcia? Used to play shortstop for Baltimore. That Javier Garcia? That's what? who we're looking for? Yeah. <laughs> that Javier Garcia. I was a shortstop. Anyway, sounds like some paranoid horse shit. I thought Got I was like a fucking pitcher. ball player. There's a medical center. Gonna go ninjas way back in here or anything better than out. a shortstop. <laughs> Not that easy, man. We've seen them make haze before, and they ain't afraid to use them. All right. Let's hang out here for a while. Smoke break. Damn it. We need a distraction. How's your throwing arm? That's a very round rock. It's like soup. Okay, um, can I? The window would be better, though. That's just gonna bounce right off. What the fuck? Holy crap, my throat. Shit, wow. We need to get the fire crew or that shit could burn down the block. I really should have been the pitcher, not the shortstop. I kick ass. He looks like Dave Chappelle. Out a window. Exactly like him. Did the trick, didn't it? Show off. But seriously, though, if you're going to do something, go big or go home. Don't screw around with this, you know, the small stuff. Go balls to the walls. That's the only way I ever go. My balls are all over those walls. <laughs> you guys find hey. out. Tell her we're moving Plus Kate. Three. Okay. Sounds good. We'll meet you here. Wait, she's Hi. in the same place? Hey, Kate, what up? What up, Sadu? Zah. We thought you were. I was. Nobody can kill old worried. shortstop Javier. Like, a lot. Uh, hey, hey, buddy. Buddy. I'm fine. I'm just fine. They said you guys were denied entry. It's true. We're on borrowed time. The people who run this place, they're ruthless. We have to move. Where's my dad? Is he coming? Hey, man. Javi, where uh, is he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's taking care, taking of, care of a few right loose ends. And right cool, now, cool. he needs me to take care of you. Oh, okay. David has a house in town. He thinks we'll be okay there. Then let's go. Wait, Javi? While you were gone, this woman, Joan, came by. I felt like she was sizing me up. It was creepy. She implied David was in trouble, like he was no longer in charge. She kept saying Gabe and I didn't need to worry, but it only made me worry more. Joan's been running this place behind David's back. She's pulling the strings. What do you mean? The people who shot you? Answer to her. She ordered raids on other settlements. We found all this stuff from Prescott. I knew it though. She she's, a, she's a she's a stone cold fox, yo. David's rounding up allies to confront her right now. Javi, I know you know this already. This is not our fight. We already lost Mari because of these people. Now, okay, just calm down with this leaving is about stuff. To become a war zone. Uh. What? what do you mean? It's David's fight, Kate, and we're in it with him. He needs our help. Kate, come You're on. You're not hearing me. This is not our problem. What's going on? Tripp said we had to move to David's house. We're not doing that. Tripp said We're we had to go to David's house. Before it's too late. Getting out? You shouldn't even be sitting up. What? What about my dad? We can't just leave him. Gabe, we don't even know who he is anymore. We have to get away before he gets us all killed. But... He won't know where we are. Again. I can't go back to how things were before. Bruh. I'm we, sorry. We gotta stay. I just can't. I think she hated him. We're gonna him. go to David's house. Uh, well, she Javi. didn't hate him. It's the best bet we got. It's all we got. Like, literally. Kay, you can't move. I've got a gun in the room they gave me. You're a broken like woman. I might need it. 
Gotta wait till you're better, man. I'll come with you. We'll catch up with you guys. Sounds good. The only thing that would happen is she would get on the road, and then her stitches would open up, and then she would die, like immediately. Don't. Now you're just being like David, man. I didn't see Clem with you guys. Is she okay? Nah, she did, yo. I know. She's uh, she's tough, super cool. I don't know. Uh, It'd be nice to hear she's all right. Yeah. If we run into her. She could really use a friend right now. Yeah. A boyfriend. We need to go. Okay? I'm trying to set them up. Okay. I think he's too much of a pussy bitch, though, to be with her. <laughs> no, he's he's alright, you know. He's, he's a good guy. He's, he's got a tender heart and everything. That's what you need, man. That's what you need. That's what Clem needs. You know this is what David lives for. We right? are so gonna get caught. What? A brawl. I only ever saw him truly happy when he was talking about being at war. The war what did he even do in war anyway? That was the best day of his life. Yeah, it's well, he did punch me in the life. face, I guess, and he she liked definitely it. He could get pretty warlike from time to time. My jaw still aches occasionally. No, I'll bet it does. Man, he's actually got a pretty sick house. Took your damn time. Come on, we have to hurry. Wait, where are Wait you going? Second. David told us to come here. He's talking to the others now. Trust me, shit's about to fly. He's gonna need our help. We gotta get on the move. Okay, he's waiting uh... for us. There's no more time to lose. Holy I... shit. Well, come on, let's go. They'll be safe here. Don't worry. I think things are gonna go really, I'll come back really you. badly. Both of you. You better. If Joan is that powerful, I think that she is just gonna steamroll us, because everybody's so scared of her, and then we're gonna go into jail or something, and then bad things are gonna happen. Shit's gonna roll downhill. And we're just gonna be in the eye of a shit of cane. The shit ropes are gonna be snaring us. The shit hawks are just gonna be swooping in, just taking us off and taking us off to the shit nests. I don't like your tone, David. If this is about your brother. Don't pretend like you don't know what this is about. Oh, you don't have a lot more to time, do you? Me? You must be joking. Well, I'm you can't. I got a few things to say about I you. I can count on your brother. We're gonna fix this. Together. All right, all right, all right, all right. This is this is better work, bruh. I did what you asked. You better not make me regret it. What's going on here? We're just getting started. And Damn it! I didn't bring Max. I should have brought Max. You smuggled your brother back into Richmond. I wonder if that would have made what a difference. What happened probably to you, not. David? Probably not. It hurts I mean, it's to see you betray your own people. It's telltale. You've got some damn nerve. We used to be so close. Ah, uh, no. David didn't betray anyone. He can be hard to deal with, but he's always been loyal. I wish I could say the same thing. I'm gonna you. try and squirrel my way what out of this. What are you people talking about? So this is your play? First you accuse Badger, then you come after me. Would someone please explain what's going on? I can. Oh, no, 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 no. Go ahead, Lonnie, tell us. Oh no, she already set somebody up. They attacked us. Damn it. Murdered We're screwed. Max We're boned. Badger. You son of a bitch. We're screwed. They would have got me too. But I was lucky. He yeah, did you well, I'm not getting out Those of it. Those bastards deserve to die. What? Those are our people you're talking about. Damn it. They I just I lost some points right there. Killing and looting on Joan's orders. Is that true, Joan? <laughs> It's nothing but a smoke screen. A pretty damn transparent one, if you ask me. Oh, uh, yeah. Lonnie, you, th you think you're so smart. tell me this isn't true. Come on, Lonnie. Be a bro. Be a bro, Lonnie. Don't be we a bitch. We did that. Raided those damn. communities. Hurt those people. Because David told us to. Lonnie, you punk. Not Joan. 
That's why you wear those I'm knee sorry, pads. David, I can't do this Get down anymore. and suck some huge cock. Big old moose dong. This is wrong. I am asking you, please tell them the truth. This is bullshit. If you knew He's covering for Joan. David, just stop. We knew this couldn't last forever. We confronted him. Me, Badger, and Max. We were done. We let him know. He said he didn't need us anymore. Not with his brother here now. That's when he... That's when Badger and Max... That's enough! David, stop! Paul, you have to stop her. Or the blood from those raids, it's on your hands. Don't let Joan get away with this. Why do they Paul. give you such horrible options? Grow a fucking backbone, please. Stand up for what's right. I think you've caused enough trouble. Don't try and drag him into your mess. The things you've done, they're an assault on what we built here. You and your brother, you're going to have to answer for them. I still have friends here, allies. This won't stand. Oh my god, this is not yourself, working. David. I'm sorry to say it, but you're done here. They were our family, David. How could you? I should have brought Max. Oh yeah. I'll give you family. David. This, this never works. It never ends well like this, David. 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 Is it is no, no, dude, no. That's where it ends. The cliffhangers. That's how they get you. That's how I watched four seasons of The Walking Dead in two days when it first came out. Every episode is a cliffhanger. It works every time. Bait and switch. They got me again. Now I have to know what happened. <sighs> the only problem is with these games, even though they give you a cliffhanger every time, is I don't feel that the choices matter. And in the last episode, I checked all the alternate choices, and every single outcome was the exact same. You couldn't change any of them. Maybe you'd like change some of the dialogue or some of the there somebody would live like slightly longer but the end outcome was always the same well in episode two kenny or what's her face would live but and you might see kate in this episode but oh man i, ju I just don't feel that the choices matter ever in these games they don't they don't feel like they carry any weight and then like for the next episode you're kind of like oh well i remember that guy that he said that thing one time and then he died immediately after i started liking him i mean her <laughs> i'm not gonna go as serious i swear man all right did you honor your brother's request yeah did you try and save aj hell yeah 85 who were these assholes? Who was, who was the fourteen percent? I don't trust you. Whoever you are, fourteen percent. How did Badger die? You and three point nine percent of players let someone else kill Badger. Whoa. Three point nine percent. 4.6% of players killed Badger quickly, so I'm the low- I like to take the unstomped path. I like to forge a new path through unconquered lands. <laughs> Alright, um... 70% of players destroyed Badger's skull. What? What do you mean they destroyed Badger's skull? They, like, rip his head off and, like, skull fuck him or something? Like, Jesus. 21% of players let Badger turn. Wait, he turns into a zombie? Say what? Alright, what else we got? 
Did you accept Max's offer? You and 41.8% of players killed Max. Yeah, I'm in the minority. Forge ahead on new paths. All right, what else we got? Who did you side with in the end? You and 53% of players stuck with David's plan. Damn it. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. It's pretty even. I don't trust you either. Percent of people who didn't go with David's plan. All right, so these are the end choices, I guess. There's a lot of green here. Green always means go, so does that mean that I will do good in the next episode? Who really knows, but I can't wait for it. Just like every single ep the end of every episode, this happens. That was a wild ride, though. <laughs> wild. It didn't disappoint. I've heard some people saying that, like, this, you know, the, the new frontier isn't that great, and it's just more of the same, and... Well, isn't that what you motherfucking game for? <laughs> you don't buy an apple and expect to get an orange, do you? Just makes sense, right? But one complaint that I kind of get is, is they're too short. Like, the episodes are just too short. I get it quantity, I mean, quality over quantity, but they just feel short to me for some reason. And... The choices feel like they carry even wet less weight than they did before. It's weird, it's weird. I don't know what it is about this one, but ever since I played the Batman Telltale game, I don't really trust Telltale. I really didn't like the Batman Telltale. I thought it was horrible. A lot of people... <laughs> Get out of here with it. Go away. Go. Never. No. You're horrible. You suck. You're trash. I wipe my boots with you every day. I wipe my ass with that game. No. And don't even try and advertise Michonne to me, because I will kick you right in the teeth. Anyway, I guess we'll be seeing you tomorrow. <laughs> on another episode of a different game because this game is over and you know it probably won't come out to like July or something they usually have like a six week or six month or however long it takes turn around Sue so, see you tomorrow body up but uh, kick some ass I think as Jesus tends to do so different from when he was in the Bible man no mercy oh man <laughs> Take the whole horde down by yourself. The Messiah is back with an attitude. <laughs>